makes me crazy I dream about a baby Gazing on days and contagious show my baby We better go ahead and jump into hate love a little. Yeah. How can you hate love a little? Yeah. But we about to find out. This Amy Holland. This is Amy Holland. Yeah. Yes, this is Michael McDonald's wife. That's true. That yeah. is true. All right. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Some people talk about it, learn how to live without it, love. Some people fight about it, go through the night without it, love. I've been hanging out with the working hard. I'm not even sure how we made it this far. Yeah. You know what it kind of reminds me of? Michael. It do, don't it? Yeah. Wow. I almost literally can hear him singing this. Like <laughs> the back vocals? Yes. <laughs> like literally, like the way she sounds. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, when she's talking about mm -hmm. hate love a little. Yeah, I'm mm -hmm. just like, I literally can hear he must he might have probably wrote this. I I you know, I'm not gonna discredit her because I don't know who wrote it, but I wouldn't be surprised if he wrote this song mm -hmm. for her. And and maybe he even sung it for her and she sung it like him. But she sounds like maybe because we know that isn't that weird? Yeah, it, it, it almost sounds. It sounds like <laughs> she's singing and Michael singing at the same time. No, I don't hear Michael McDonald. Well, I don't at hear all. him, but it's like I can. You can. I hear him. Obviously, he's not on the song, but right. like I could. I, I could hear him. Yeah. On this. Yeah. If you're looking to run, you're taking your time.
Amy Holland. I'm loving the strings on this one too. I did too. Yeah, whoever is playing them, that 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 probably was the fiddle. Because <laughs> because I always get that wrong. But yeah, <laughs> the sound in this though, like definitely sounds like a. Oh, I'm gonna get this dang old thing. I'm sorry, y'all. I didn't mean. I'm sorry. <laughs> but the sound, the sound in this song though, like definitely sounded like um, a Michael Michael McDonald like. You hear like his tone a little bit. Absolutely, possibly. it's almost like she's singing in his tone too. Like it's so I don't even know how to describe that. It's it's I feel bad saying it because like she just sung the mess out of this song, being that it is her song. But maybe like I said, because we know that, like it just sounded. A you little can hear bit it in like the a, vocals a little bit, yeah. especially in the chorus too. And yeah, like because she had like the double vocals, so you could hear like her back vocals kind of having it having that tone as well. Yeah, yeah. And also, she's talking about, like, hate love just a little. It's like, you, I, I feel like a lot of people kind of go through that particular point where they, you know, where they've <coughs> given love, shown love, know what love is, lost love. So when, when it comes back around for them to kind of get back in that situation again, to fall in love, to give that love again, it's like they might kind of hate love a little because of the way that it makes you feel. You might not really want to completely try like she was saying, like you, you don't want to try mm. in regards to yeah. love because you know the downfalls of what love could bring sometimes. Yeah. So I feel like that's kind of what she was talking about in the song. It's like sometimes you hate love a little because of the way that it makes you feel when you really truly love somebody. Okay. You know. I agree. That's and you, and you right and, on with and, that. And you go through those things in regards to just life's ups and downs, loves, ups and downs. Right. And and that's what she's speaking about. Yeah. Yeah. Custom your body, boy, I'm addicted. Insisting commitment, predicted your intentions. I've waited too long. 